coverage you can count on. Channel 3 Eyewitness News, first at 4. Here are your top stories on this Tuesday afternoon. The president prepares to give his State of the Union address. The White House says he'll call for us to come together after two years of disagreements. Doctors at Vanderbilt University hope new technology will help find the moms at high risk of preterm labor and catch them early. Every one minute, one in nine babies is born too early in Tennessee. Plus, students will start entering the doors here at Olivet Baptist as the church is starting to open a new private school. Coming up uh, on Channel 3, we'll let you know what the church pastor had to say makes the school different. Thank you for watching. I'm David Carroll. And I'm Latrice Curry. Cindy Sexton has the day off. Breaking right now, a Pennsylvania appeals court is denying former Penn State football coach Jerry Sandusky's appeal for a new trial. The appeals court has ordered him to be resentenced for his 45 count child sexual abuse conviction. They say he was improperly sentenced using mandatory minimums. He's currently serving a 30 to 60 year term in prison. Sandusky's lawyers say he'll continue to fight for a new trial. His arrest led Penn State to push out Hall of Fame head coach Joe Paterno and then University President Graham Spann.